is chilling my fellow toasters this is toaster chills here and welcome back to another video and today yes i am in my room slash studio or gaming setup wherever you want to call it i haven't f completely unpacked yet after getting back from my um dad's house from um actually remember previously today well earlier today yes i was um i recorded my five nights at freddy's part four i mean part three i think so um yeah i just got back to my house today and um i haven't fully unpacked yet so um Today I have a really special unboxing for you. I got some new equipment for my Blue Snowball mic and I wanted to unbox it all for you and do a sound test and review for everything. So um, yeah, let's unbox. Alright guys, <clears throat> I am here with the first box. This one was a little bit heavier than the other. So we will start by cutting it open and see what's inside. By the way, <clears throat> what I got I got a pop filter. <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> I got a um I got a boom arm. I also got um and I got a shock mount to hold my microphone. So what's inside of here is um I think this is the boom arm. There's a heavy box right here. It says Mike boom Mike boom stand. <laughs> so yeah, this is the boom stand. <clears throat> and there's some packaging paper. Put these boxes aside and take a look at the boom arm. This is a pretty nice package. I think they packed it well. They did good taping, and it looks like a pretty sturdy box as far as I know. <laughs> So, let's cut the sides open. This might take a minute. There we go. There's one side. Okay. And then, here's the other side. Right here. And now that's cut. Oh, it wasn't cut all the way. Never mind. Alright, so I'm going to open it up right here and it just it slips out like that. So, what we have here is, I believe, right here. Hold on, I'll take it out of the paper first. Paper is hard. <laughs> all right, so I'm slowly picking. All right, I got it. All the way it's stuck in a spot. There's a few controls here. We first we have this knob right here, and I think this adjusts. Um, there's this right here that adjusts whether you can turn this or not. I'm pretty sure or not. Okay. Oh wait, actually, yeah. And then um, this screw right here is believed to screw the, uh, the shock mount on, I believe. So, um, yeah, we will just put this aside here and get on to our next box, which is right here. You know what? Put this over here. It's better. So, moving on to the second box. Oh, it's not fully taped. <clears throat> um, where's my knife? Oh, there it is. <laughs> So, I'm just going to cut this open here. There we go, that wasn't too hard. And Alright, so, as you, I guess, there's not really, it's not really in a box this time. So first we have a pop filter here. This looks about six inches wide. Um, next, we have a shock mount, which with the screw right there, I think is pretty cool. We'll just put those aside and get the box in here. So first, we'll take a look at the um, pop filter. 
this is in plastic, the shock mount is not. Um, oh, that's cool, they kind of buttoned it up almost. So, um, oh, it's right there. I need to find the opening for it. So, this is opening here, and then you just slip it out. Oh, the tape out of my hands. I guess, hold on. Oh, wait. Is there a side to open? Okay, there's another side to open over here. There we go. So now, I'll just pull this out. Oh, wait. Here we go. I'll pull this out. Um. I think this is like a manual for microphones, I'm not sure, but we'll just set that aside here. And now here's the pop filter. We'll take a look at this. Um, again, you don't open it up a little bit more. Alright. So here's the pop filter. It's got it's not too heavy, but the metal right here makes it a little heavy. Um, I think I'm not sure, but I believe this looks like I don't really know what this is made of, but it's very, very, very soft. And um it's um wrapped right here with a rubber band, so I'm just gonna undo this here. And it's got, oh wait, oh there's technical difficulties here, uh, oh, I got it. So, there's a bendable wire right here so you can adjust it any way you want, and um, yeah, that's that, I'll protect it, well, put it back right here to the side for now, and we'll take a look at the shock mount. So this holds is going to hold my blue snowball. And there's a little circle right there. I don't know what that is. But we are going to open this open it up. And it seems to be put together the same way as the um as the uh um the pop filter. It's got the button thing. No, I think this thing might be a little bit heavier because it's like full metal. So. Alright. Get this side. Uh, oh, that was loud. So. Oh, there goes the box. <laughs> so, um, here's the shock mount. You can adjust this right here, it's the screwable. It's a little loose, but I'll figure that out. And here's the screw part where you stick it on the boom stand. So, um, yeah, I'm going to set this up, and I'll check back with you guys then. Guys, I've, 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 as you can see, I haven't set up my laptop yet, but this is what the mic setup looks like. Um, here we have the pop filter, we have the boom arm, and we have the shock mount. And here's my blue snowball back there. So, um, yeah. I will now, we will now do the mic test. Just set everything up as you can see here. This is my whole setup right here. Here's the pop filter right here. Um, I hooked that up to the back of my boom arm right here, which you can see right here. This is the boom arm. And then here's the shock mount right here. Hooked on, sorry, hooked on to the boom arm right here. Um, you just twist it on right there. And um, this little white spot right here is my blue snowball. So um, yeah, guys, this was basically basically my mic, mic setup um, and video and unboxing thing for all my new equipment. So hopefully my video quality should be a lot better now. You might hear little crackles, but that would get filtered in with all the game audio in my video games. I mean, so it's not really a big problem, but I will get that solved at some point. Um, 
So, um, yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like to show me that you did. You guys can also subscribe for, um, uh, for more upcoming way cool content like this. You can also leave a comment in the comment section below about what you felt about this video or if you'd suggest any videos that you guys want me to do because it's all about you guys. And like always, stay chill with my fellow toasters. This is Toaster Chessie. Peace out. See you all in the next video. Bye-bye.